Hey, bud. What you do? Nothing. What you up to, Cletus? Uh, hunting. Hunt, hunting what? Retirees? Nah, just stuff. Windows, antenna, tires. Vermin! Ah, so that was you. Tis the season for it. I don't give a shit about no season. <laughs> oh, good, huh? Don't let the regulations get you down. That's what I'm saying. Hey, hey, hey. You want to come hunting with me? It'd be real neighborly of you. Hell, why not? All right, then. Up here with you. I got just a thing. Let's raise some hell, neighbor. Oh, I'm in. I'll introduce you to one of my all-time favorite pastimes. <laughs> You're gonna love this. Okay, you see them three big satellite dishes? A decent shot, and they'll go down easier than a whore's drawers. You're a real pillar of the community. Half the folks in this town would sell their own mother, and most of the other half already did. Screw them. <laughs> no more reality TV for you, Mrs. Gilbert. Okay, one more for the road. Yeah, that's it. Give him hell. Shoot another one. Boom! <laughs> Didn't I tell you this would be more fun than a barrel full of pussies? Ooh, you're a classy date, Cletus. No denying that. <laughs> now drive us up to that abandoned motel. I got an even better idea. So, what now? We gonna try our luck on something less stationary. Ooh, liberals? Nothing as slippery as that. You'll see. Ain't she a beauty? Drives like a dream. You've got way too much time on your hands. Nah, this is just a bit of foolery. I've been busier than hell with the real hunting. The money and wild organic meat these days, you wouldn't believe. Them hipsters will give you their parents' last dime for it. It's gotten so I can't even keep up with the demand no more. All this eat local, small batch, farm to table bullshit. You know, I could maybe use another pair of hands if I can get you up to snuff with that rifle. You keep on criticizing my shooting, you'll be starring in a snuff with that rifle. Here we are. I bet you never shut out the tires on a car before? Oh, you'd be surprised. Well, let's see what you got then. Ain't you gonna shoot anything, Cletus? Nah, I do this all the time, and I wanna see how you deal with a moving target. This is perfect right here. Pick a car and shoot a tire. Good, plain, old-fashioned fun. Sick beauty! And again, Trevor! Hellfire! Nice! Go on, one more, just for the hell of it. Shit for brains! Not the car, Trevor! Anybody can pay the body work. Hellfire, Trevor, you ain't rushing this, are you? Looks like maybe you could use some more practice. Right, let's change it up. Come on, follow me.
Just two fellers killing time in small town America. Don't get much better than this, does it? The two most popular guys in town. Am I glad I ran into you? Ain't nowhere near this fun being antisocial on your own. Whatever cranks your tractor, I say. What's up next on the hillbilly anarchist agenda? Ever shot anything with a face? Actually, let me ask it again. Ever shot anything with a face on four legs? Now, Cletus, it's important you realize I'm a man plagued by vicious rumors. Fine. Let's head for the roof. I seen some coyotes hanging around down by the road. Reckon it would be real neighborly of us to get rid of a couple. And we are nothing if not neighborly. We'll get a better shot from up here. Seem. Looks like we got two packs of coyotes down there. Take a few of them out and the rest should scatter. <laughs> Sing to me now, song dog, and another. Drop it like a bad habit. I think you got one more in you, Trevor. Damn varmint's always getting at the trash and chicken. Worst thing about the Alamo Sea, coyotes. I don't know. I can think of a couple more things. What? That should do it. Nicely done. I reckon you should tag along next time I go hunting out at Polito Bay. I'll show you how to bag an elk. Ah, why not? All right, gotta go. I'll send you a text when I'm about. Baby, I am so messed up. Mm, you look so effing hot. I want to hump you right now. We're never going to find a cab out here. Are you okay to drive? Hey, hey you, buddy. Can you do us a massive favor? It's the little lady's birthday and we are really fucked up. Can you drive us back to our motel? Our car's right there. It won't take long. You can use my wheels, no problem. But of course, you two are a hot mess, I love it. You're a legend, bro. We'll get in the back, out of your way. Baby, don't breathe whiskey on the nice man. So where can I take you two blacked out, young lovelies? We staying at the Hotel Southwest from here. Thank you so much. You have like the oh, best I gotta tits get in my the eyes whole checked. world. If I didn't have to work for a living, I would just play with them all day. Oh, you so bad. Oh, that... Tickles, Abby. Yeah, you like that? Just wait till we get back to the motel. Mmm, I'm gonna get medieval on those puppies. We'll really bring you close together. What do you got? What do you got? I heard you're interested in taking care of some lost travelers for a price. And so it is. And so it is. Leave the body, take the gold. 
gonna meet a bitch, that's where you're gonna meet one, you know what I'm saying? Hey, hey. Give me a sip of that. What? Come on! My throat's dry as a motherfucker. Why? Is your mother dry when you're... <laughs> what the fuck is that, huh? Nothing. Well, it didn't sound like nothing, all right? It didn't seem like nothing. I don't think that it was nothing! I didn't mean nothing by it, old man. Old man? Old man! Fuck you, you creepy old motherfucker! That's right. I said it. Creepy. Old. Motherfucker. No. Jesus. Huh? No, come on. Get what? Up. What? What? Sorry. Now, where sorry. were we exactly? Huh? Get up. Get up. Ah. I'm sorry, man. We're sorry. Help. Help! There's a guy with a gun. Asshole. How have you been? Oh, simply wonderful. And you? About the same. Somewhere stuck between joyful and peachy. Even in this world full of scum and detritus, it's only right that we all bear our share. Ain't that the truth? <laughs> Take this poor wretch. On the run, desperate, alone, about to learn the true meaning of suffering. All for a few thousand bucks. Think you can find him for me? Every man has his talents, Maud, and the rigorous administration of justice is, uh, it's one of mine. That's why I love you, Trevor. I'll send you his file.
There he is. where I can see him, boyfriend. Oh, shit! I surrender! I surrender! Don't hurt me! Ah, there's a good boy. Your chariot awaits, sir. Are those guys after you or me? Oh, Roland, this could be a lot worse. It could? Chase down a depressed, overweight, middle-aged man and deliver him to a depressed, overweight, middle-aged woman in exchange for cash. It's not big bucks, but it's low effort. Quick return. How you been, Trevor? Boy, am I glad to see you. Look what you brought me. Your relentless sunny disposition, it always puts a pep in my step. I aim to please. Well, witty banter completed, I'll give you my thanks. And I'll send you another file for your inspection. Some food. No. I think we got ourselves a visitor. Let's do this the easy way. Oh. The hard way ends with you oh. on my boot. Bounty hunters, take them down. Okay, I give up. Oh, good, good. Now heal. And no begging. Sit your ass down in here. Wasn't very nice, Larry. Whoa, sold you drugs. 
Then I can only assume you started buying drugs off someone else, then started selling your own drugs. These, on their own, do not constitute good times. We had a real nice cook site this time, too. Next thing you know, whole trailer goes up like a rocket. Hello, stranger. Who's this? Hello, Maud. I found this man wandering the streets, and I thought that maybe you uh, might be able to find him a home. I think I can do that. Anyway, let's not waste all day with the inconsequential chit-chat. You'll be receiving a file from me shortly. <laughs> 